Hey Chris, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support and I hope all is well with everyone. Today we are going to find out what is your person's true intentions towards you. This person can be somebody you are thinking about or dealing with. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not apply to each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me. Chris, person's true intentions towards Aquarius. Show me more. The intention is to tell you that they were such a fool in the past and the intention is to return with the Six of Cups here. All right, Aquarius, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed in this reading. Could either be you or your person. Let's see more. Okay, so your person's intention is to start over with a world here, closing out the old chapter and starting a new chapter with you in hopes that both of you may have a second chance. I would say that the intention is pretty genuine, okay? Because the Six of Cups is right here in the middle here. So I feel like their intention towards you is genuine and that they want to return to you. And also they want to be physically intimate with you with the Ace of Wands here. Reignite passion with you. Remembering about the past. Reminisce about the past, okay? However, we've got the Fool here in reverse. So again, I do sense them um, wanting to tell you somehow that they could, they could have made a mistake here in the past, okay? And with the Three of Cups here in reverse, only for those of you whom are in a third party situation, situation this only this part will apply to you okay three of cups in reverse could indicate them uh, maybe that they, um, they want to tell you the intention is actually i feel like to tell you that they made a mistake with the third party and they no longer are together okay all that they're planning to let them go or options could be options as well other options nine of pentacles here is in reverse and we got the lovers here in reverse hmm, interesting there's a Six of Cups, it's an upright position, but not a Pentacles, it's a similar verse. I feel like the intention is to return, but they're not taking any actions. Yeah, because the Nine of Pentacles is a similar verse. All that, it's very slow. They're thinking about doing it, but they're not actually doing it. But eventually, perhaps that they will with the Ace of Wands here. They will make a choice with the Lovers here in reverse to take actions towards you. All right, so let's see a little bit more. We've got the Seven of Cups here in reverse, Six of Wands here in reverse. Again, the Aquarius, the intention is to be with you, I feel, to return to you. Because they could have experienced other options. Or maybe other options could have rejected them. Either or. Some people think that, you know, the grass is always greener, so many fishes in the sea. Yeah, it can be true to a point, but... But what I'm seeing here is this person may have thought, may have thought that they had other better options. And then they realize that that's not the truth, okay? Um, the most confident people who think that they are so good looking or they're such a catch also get rejected, okay? From time to time, or many times too. So we've got the, maybe they got rejected. So uh, Five of Pentacles here, and also we've got the Hermit here in reverse. A crazy person's true intention is to go through all the hardships with you, okay? Go, up, go through all the ups and downs with you. Uh, may not be easy, but they're willing to and to go through all of these um, hardships and go through the storm with you. With the Hermit here in reverse, I feel like Chris, this person may have been thinking a lot, going through, you know, could, could have soul search in regards of what had happened between the two of you. So I feel like now they're realizing it and they know very clearly that they've been such a fool in the past. Okay, whatever they did in the past was so dumb. I do sense, again, they, they, they used to like all this attention from other people and it kind of make their head got bigger. But now, for whatever reason, maybe they got rejected. You know, maybe karma could have gone, uh, gone back around to them. And this is why I feel like now they feel really, really sad, I would say. Um, the intention is to do the right thing, to, to do the right thing and to start over with you, of course, with the world here. Start over and change the direction of this connection in hopes that it could be more of a positive connection. Maybe there could be a second chance to revive this connection with the death card here in reverse. So now they're appearing as the king of pentacles if you're dealing with a Virgo Capricorn Taurus, but it can be any sign, any fixed signs here that I'm seeing, okay? Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, pretty strong as well. Some fire energy I'm seeing here, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. 
But uh, Chris, uh, the intention is to treat you well, treat you properly, okay? Be somebody reliable for you, be committed, um, be responsible, be a responsible partner. And the Eight of Cups here, they want to move on. The intention is to move on from the past, okay? Not wanting to relieve the past where it could have been uh, confusing or chaotic at one point. Um, also, the Seven of Cups can indicate delusions. If it seems like such a blur or that the whole thing just didn't seem real in the past or if they're not being real to you or genuine towards you now, I feel like the intention is to be genuine towards you, okay? Uh, and the death card in reverse, of course, wanting to revive this connection. Hmm. Don't want it to be over. Their, their intention is not want this to be over at all, okay? To them, it's not over. Let's see more. Nine of Pentacles in reverse, perhaps because they need you in some way, shape, or form. The intention is not wanting to see you being single. They don't want you to be single. They want you for themselves. And we've got the Ten of Swords here, Aquarius. This may actually indicate them, um, again, wanting to put all of this behind, behind the both of you. Um, and in hopes that both of you can not be too stressful again, okay? I feel like both of you could have gone through a lot of stress in the past or currently. Um, some of you are separated from this person, some of you could be on your way to separating and some of you are going through some issues but I feel like generally uh, Chris, your person just doesn't want to stress about this anymore wanting to put all of this behind them, wanting to offer you the king of pentacles here so a very solid offer I would say, uh, commit, committed offer uh, if both of you are actually at a distance from each other, their intention is to come to you, okay? If not metaphorically, they just want to move towards you because the Eight of Cups here, for some reason, I feel like it's kind of walking towards the world and the Wheel of Fortune here. So for a lot of you, maybe you are at a distance from each other. If that's the case, they really want to be physically there for you, move towards you or have you go towards them. Or take you towards them either or but if it's not the distance again it could just indicate them uh, wanting a second chance with you okay the intention to have the second chance with you let's forget about the past and let's start anew and don't forget about I feel like the intention is not wanting you to forget about the past the good times both of you have shared with each other definitely wanting to be physically intimate with you all right Aquarius this is your reading. <laughs> Hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with a video on the screen right now. This is the video from my second vlog channel if you're interested to check it out. And also, I'm open for bookings, personal readings. If you guys would like to book me, my information is in the description box below. And Aquarius, I post your videos almost every single day. If you'd like to be notified every time when I post your videos, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button because I don't post it at the same time. All right. I'm not sure if I already said that, but anyway, take care, Chris. Bye.